Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. A few weeks ago, I recorded a video on The Thrill is Gone by B.B. King. So I thought I would do a follow-up. I've recorded a guitar loop that has drums, a rhythm guitar part, uh, a guitar overdub, and a bass part. So I thought I'd play some lead guitar over the top of it, give you my interpretation of the song, and see what it sounds like. There's a lot of ways to interpret this song. I've seen B.B. play this song slow, really up-tempo. Don't get uh, caught in the trap of thinking that there's only one way to play a song. Or if you play it one way, you're wrong because that's not the way it's on the record. No, um, there's a lot of ways to interpret songs. You may be a, a beginner guitar player. You can't play the way the song is on the record. Or you may be a super advanced guitar player and the way it is on the record kind of bores you and you want to expand um, the song out and um, challenge yourself. So, you know, it's all about expression, interpreting the song uh, the way you do it. I can't play guitar like B.B. King. No matter how I, how I try, I end up sounding like myself anyway. So, you know, it's all about your personal interpretation. And there really is no right or wrong. Um, it's just, you know, how you feel it in the moment. So I'm going to play the loop, play the, some lead guitar over the top, and let's see what this sounds like. Okay, you know, that's improvising in a nutshell right there. Mistakes and all, you know. You're just kind of going by the seat of your pants, and sometimes you, you pull off some stuff, and sometimes you screw up. So, um, you know, I hope that gives you some ideas. If you're working on this song at home, and you're trying to figure out, well, what can I play, or, you know, how can I uh, make this song sound decent? So hopefully that gives you some ideas, and um, I hope you guys have a great Christmas and we'll talk to you in the new year. Bye.